everyone and welcome to my channel and if you're new welcome to my channel I do three to four videos a week it's all about beauty and products so welcome today I'm going to do a review of two eyeshadow palettes that I got today and I'm very excited because I have heard about this brand for a long time ago but I had never tried any of their, their products so I ordered a couple of them and I got to play with them a little bit today and I have to say that I really really like them I'm talking about Sleek and Eye Divine two, two eyeshadow palettes. This one is on the Horizon. This one was a limited edition, but I found it on the internet, so I probably think it's, it is still available. Then it's this Sunset palette. They are so beautiful. I fell in love with the shades and I'm very happy that I got them. Uh, let's start with this. And on the horizon this is how it, the eyeshadow palette looks like it's plastic packaging it's black in sleek it's a little bit dirty because I used it on my eye look today so that's what I have on my eyelids and it feels nice firm and I think this would be great to travel with this palette and if you open it it comes with a mirror let me see and on this plastic you have all the names of the shadows look how beautiful they are this is how the eyeshadows look like very beautiful and I really like these colors uh, they are let me just say they are very they are pigmented but not too pigmented when you put them on your eyes and I think that's a good thing because if uh, an eyeshadow is too pigmented and you take a darker color and you put it on your eyes then it's kind of hard to to blend in and you get that dark color maybe that you didn't want to so when you have take a little bit of this eyeshadow it's very easy to build up so you can get the intense that you want want now I will do the swatches I will start with the up here and uh, show you how they look so, here's the first color. And this one is called, what is it called? Bonfire. We take the second color. And this one is Sugar Maple. And then we take the third color. And this one is called Beach. And then we go over to the darker colors, the green one. And this one is called Moss. Raindrop is this one. And down is this one called the blue one. Here are all the swatches. I really, really like all the colors so easy to build up and blend they do look patchy f at first when you put them on your eyes with a brush but it's easy to blend in and it's easy to build up so you really get that color that you really want now we're going over to this road down here and the darkest color in this palette is chestnut and that's this one it's very beautiful I'm not good at explaining colors but I will I'll just show you so many people are so good oh this one is a little bit red and orange and beautiful I'm not like that I have a hard time to explain but this one is what I have in my crease and this and it's called harvest moon and this one is fawn this gold yellow one this uh, is so beautiful this is this one is willow dark draw is this one i don't know if you can see it's really light one let me do another swatch with this one and the final one is pine cone i think it yes pine cone that was right and here you get the other colors very beautiful really really like this palette 
And what I think that it's great with this palette is that you can do so many different eye looks. The, for this look I used, let me show you, the crease I used first the beach, this one, and then I went over to the harvest moon. And then I did take this uh, chestnut a little bit here and took it a little bit, little bit into my crease. And then on my old eyelid I have this bonfire. This beautiful one, orangey color, it's a little bit shiny too. And then at the end, in the middle of my eyelid, I took a little bit of foam, this yellow one. So I really do like this palette and I'm very happy that I got it. And I will definitely buy more palettes from Sleek. But I just got these two to test, to see what I think about this palettes, what I think about the packaging, what I think about the formula of the eyeshadows, what I think, think about the pigmentation, how they, how they blend onto the eyes and what I can do with them. So I like this one. Then the second palette that I got is this Sunset palette. Looks like this. And here on the back side of this packaging you can find a lot of text about which colors you could put and blend in together. I will definitely try one of these looks that they describe on the packaging. But it's similar package as the other one. It's just the only difference I can find here is that on the first one it says on the horizon limited edition. Now these have been out for a couple of years, two, three years, I'm not really sure. I know I saw a couple of videos that are like two, three years old. So it's still available. So, yeah, you probably can find them. I'll put information down below where you can purchase it. But this one, the sunset, oh, it's so beautiful. Uh, in this palette there is only one shade that it's not shimmer. Uh, and you do get a brush or sponge brush in both of the palettes. I don't know, I don't know why they put these brushes. I never used this one and I don't know even how to use it so I won't use it. This is how it looks like. They are very very beautiful colors. You also get this plastic over. Let me take out this brush. It's really annoying. This is how this palette looks. Eyeshadows are very beautiful. And let me do swatches for you now. I will begin with this road up here. And the first color is the black one and it's matte and this one is Nightfall and it's the only matte eyeshadow in this palette. And then it's Horizon. I hope I pronounce these colors right. But and this one is so beautiful. And the third one is... And this one is... Uh, Afterglow, I really like this color. Looks so beautiful. This is this one is. I really want to do a makeup look with this orangey one. Sunrise is the yellow one. I don't know if you can see it from there. And the skyline is the blue one, shimmery too. And this blue one is kind of hard. It's not as pigmented and the easy as the other one, but it, you can definitely build it. And here are the colors. I don't know if you can. The lights are kind of bad today, but look how beautiful they are. I don't usually wear these kind of colors, but I really want to experiment. I really want to try. And I think they look beautiful, so I promised to myself for, for this year to start using more happy colors for my eye makeup. So I will definitely do that. Let's take this second road and now we are going to do swatches for these colors down here. And the first color on this road is Dusk. And this one is so beautiful. It's like metallic purple. Eve is the second color on this road. These colors are very pigmented. Down is the third color.
The next color is Golden Hour. And this one is not as pigmented as the others, but it's definitely easy to build up. And it's kind of orangey yellow shimmery color. Starry is the next one. And the last color is Sirene, I think it's pronounced. Very beautiful. Now, I think that I would need to use other colors in my crease because I just don't prefer to do shimmery colors in my crease. Very beautiful palette. Now, I did bought something new from Sleep 2 that I haven't used. Of course, this is the Candy Time uh, Balm. It's a balm from your, for your lips. And uh, it's very beautiful. They are not too pigmented. Really, very creamy. I have this in the middle on my lips today. It goes with the eye look. It feels nice on my lips. They are moisturized and it contains vitamin E. This. So, very good for your lips. Like I said in my last video, I'm not really a um, lip gloss girl or balm girl, but I do like to use sometimes during the summer when I don't really want to have lipstick on something a little bit color and shimmer. I will take this, it's Tutti Frutti color. And this one is very cute. Looks like lipstick. A little bit sweet, but not strong at all. Not strong to smell at all. Very creamy, very nice on the lips. Really like this one, these. They are a little bit patchy, but you have to remember it's a balm, not a lipstick. So uh, balms often, because they're so creamy, the color doesn't even on your lips. So it's, it is a little bit patchy, but that's what it comes with a balm. The next color is the one that I have on my lips and it's Jelly Bean. Like candy. It's a beautiful orangey color. It's very nice. Not too dark. They look darker in the packaging if you compare with the swatch. And the last color that I got is this and it's Cherry Drop. Drop. So beautiful, look. Let me just swatch here. The first and the third one, they are kind of darker and more pigmented. And then this orange one that I wear today. Very nice, very nice for the summer. Uh, if you don't want to wear lipstick, but you still want a touch of a color on your lips. This is how they look. So guys, that was all for today. I hope you liked this video. If you did, thumb, give a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do that so you don't miss any of my videos. And thank you for watching. See you soon. Bye!